Hello everyone, we are only two weeks away from crowning the voice champion. I had the opportunity to sit down with some of the top semi-finalists to talk about tonight's experience and what to expect next round. Take a look. I have a question for all of you. As we're nearing the finals and the heat is on, what keeps the nerves down and the butterflies away for you guys on stage? Excitement. I mean, at the end of the day, like we are living our dream in the middle of a pandemic. So, I mean, just gratitude, I think, Period. flows through all of us. And that really just kind of, I, the nerves are there. I know the nerves haven't gone away for me yet. I don't, I don't think they've gone away for any of us. But you use it as fuel to complete the mission. And so for me, I would say gratitude really is what helps taper the nerves in the moment. But they're still there. <laughs> Most definitely. Like, I don't think I've ever done a show in my life where I haven't been nervous. I don't care how how wonderful you are uh, on the stage. People who say they don't get nervous, I don't actually believe that. Uh, I mean, because you care so much about what you're doing that it's, it's odd to not get nervous. I don't care how much you're prepared. Now, that's different. Being prepared very i'm very 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 prepared but i will always still get a little nervous because you want it to be you want the audience to receive it in the way that you've um uh thought of it to to go over so but no i, I i'm still nervous every time i get on the stage but more than anything i'm more than the nerves i'm excited because that adds positivity into the atmosphere and more than that there is a desire to have a connection with you, the audience. So that that's the thing that's thrilling. What about you, Bailey? I'm kind of the same way, except I um, I kind of need the nerves. The nerves kind of um, help me perform better. And um, I don't know. I feel like if you're not nervous, then you may not <laughs> you may not be excited because you need to be nervous uh, when you're performing in front of four of these legends. And um, performing in front of this audience and you're performing in front of America and hoping to earn America's love at the same time. So, um, I don't know. It's really exciting, but it's really nerve wracking at the same time. Well, uh, this certainly in the competition, you guys have had the opportunity to sing with your fellow contestants, but this was an opportunity to sing with your fellow contestants and not be directly competing against them. So I'm curious for you guys tonight. It was fun for for us. Like it's the first time, other than the duets, where we had so much fun learning these these iconic songs that were really really trendy and bringing some of them back into the forefront. So we had a really great time. Uh, as we say, some of these songs are bops. So bringing them back and making them popular again, maybe we helped to do that. But I had a great time singing with Bailey and Cammy. And for us, it was kind of a Team Legend reunion because Cammy was on Team Legend. Um, so it was, it was really a wonderful opportunity to sing with, with them who are, I mean, they're just incredible. I agree. I had a good old country time, baby. Um, I got to, uh, sing with, um, Ian, who is, you know, on the country, on the folk side of country and Ben Allen, who is the definition of country music. And I had a good old time. Um, when they came out and, and dress rehearsal and everybody had a guitar, it was four guitars on the stage. I said, I need something in my hand too. And so I demanded a tambourine <laughs> so that I could participate. Um, but it was really fun. And um, I feel like less pressure than everything else because it was just supposed to be this fun moment. And I had a blast, if you couldn't tell. I definitely had a blast with John and Cammie. Um, we sang a song that was definitely out of my comfort zone because um, I am a country singer. I don't know if y'all could tell or not. <laughs> um, it was definitely out of my comfort zone, but it was still so fun. And it kind of um, opened my eyes to um, kind of a different perspective. Like, hey, I could I could do something else besides country. Even though, um, you know, traditional country is what I love, I can still do something else also. And Tam, I'm sure you agree because you sang that country song and I loved it. <laughs> The Voice airs on Monday and Tuesday on NBC. Be sure to check your local listings. I'm Adeze and you've just been buzzed.